He made him who knew no sin to be sin on our behalf so that we might become the righteousness of God in him. The gospel of this great crown of doctrine, of this majestic diadem of theology, the center stone that outshines them all and is the source of the glory of all other doctrines is the gospel of Jesus Christ. So many people today discussing so many things. With regard to eschatology, I can assure you, you will know absolutely everything about the second coming on the day that it occurs. <laughs> but you will be an eternity of eternities in glory and you will have not reached the foothills of the Everest of the gospel of Jesus Christ. Unending comprehension of the greatest seraph. It will not end. It will go on and on and on as we all gaze from glory to glory in what God has done for us in Christ. And I can assure you with the authority of Scripture that this is the one cure for everything that is the malady in preachers and their churches. You preacher, go farther and deeper into the heart of the gospel. And as you do, everything else will be set in place. The gospel. Know it. Be a man who dwells in your study, who reads ancient books, who cries out to God in prayer so that on Sunday, when you go to the pulpit and open up your mouth, you have something to say to God's people. Not about a mere ethic or a morality, but about a person that is incomprehensible and full of glory. Full of glory.